Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts back once again. Another reaction for you guys. Take guys, we're checking out the Witcher Blood Origin official teaser trailer that dropped a few minutes ago from Netflix. I'll be honest with you guys. At a point, I was even wondering, is this thing actually going to come out? Because this thing was announced years ago. I remember making a video years ago when this thing was announced, saying this is pretty interesting. We'll see what happens here. And then slowly over time, after they dropped a teaser, which was like a while back, there's been no word, nothing. And then I believe it was at Netflix Geeked Week, I believe, or was it during the September Netflix to, to Doom or however you pronounce it event they had? I think one of those places they actually talked about this, like for the first time in a while. And we had a release date, I believe, on December 25th, they're releasing on Christmas, I believe. I think they're still keeping the day. I'm not 100% sure. But now we have more footage. So it is still happening, it's still coming out. So. Uh, I'm curious to see what this is all about. They're saying it's set over a thousand years before the events of The Witcher, so I'm curious to see what they're going to be doing uh, in this series. And I'm assuming it's a one-off. We're not going to be seeing a season two of Blood Origin. It's literally just, you know, one and done in terms of, uh, I, I think it's like six episodes or something. Uh, anyways, so let's get into now, guys. Let's check it out. The Witcher, Blood Origin, official teaser trailer. Let's jump in and see what this show is, guys. Let's go. Stay with me, or lover, the borders are burning. Stay with me, or lover, my heart is still burning. All beginnings, all ends. Mm. Four part, okay, never mind. I thought it was six, I thought, I thought it was six episodes. Okay. A lot of violence. Whoa. This definitely was a teaser trailer. It really didn't show too, too much. But I will say, I think it actually showed more in terms of scope in terms of locations over the first teaser that, like I said, came out a long time ago. Because that first teaser, people are wondering, how much of a budget do they have? Because they're not really showing a lot. It's, it's like just a lot of open fields and everything. But it seems now they had a lot more time in post-production and kind of showing some more of the stuff involved and characters and a lot of action. A lot of action. I thought it was announced as being six episodes. So I'm guessing something changed along the way, maybe... Each episode is actually longer, so they just condense from six to four. I'm not really sure what the process was. I remember, like, that was a part of the announcement. It was going to be six episodes. Like, it was some sort of, like, you know, special, you know, event or whatever. Um, okay. We'll see what happens, you know. Hey. Like, for me, it's like this. Netflix wants to go all, all, in, all in on The Witcher. And I, mentioned, I remember m mentioning that in the announcement video I made uh, talking about this when this was announced. Netflix wants to go all in, all in on The Witcher because season one was so successful. This was back when season one. I believe they announced it after season one had come out. But now with the whole Henry Cavill situation and Liam Hemsworth replacing him for season four, I don't know. I think what they're going to need, because I don't see season four continuing, like past season four of The Witcher, I don't see a season five with Liam Hemsworth. I just don't see the show succeeding after Henry exits. But they're going to make season four with Liam. It's, it's, I'm just telling you, I don't think it's going to be successful. However, I do think there is other things they can do with this property in terms of another show focusing on another Witcher or maybe somebody else that we could follow in the world of the Witcher. And that'll be kind of the focal point. I don't know, because who knows? Maybe season four is it for the Witcher and then this is like a one and done and there is no more plans. I have no idea. Because Netflix has acquired more stuff since this because this was their big thing. But now plans are changing so we'll see what happens but in terms of this i'll check it out sure looks interesting well, I'm, I'm curious to see like an official trailer to see a more like more of what the story is and like what exactly is happening in blood origin but you know i think overall i'll check it out why not <laughs> no, no nothing really to complain about looks interesting it definitely looks better like i said than the first teaser so what you guys think of the official teaser trailer for the witcher blood origin i'm curious to know your thoughts guys whatever thoughts you have let me know in the comments below talk to you guys soon Peace out.